Om Shanti, welcome, we are here with 8th of October, Godly Blessing. Happiness is a Vardhan or happiness is a blessing which has been given to us in Brahmin life by Supreme Creator. So God says don't lose it, don't ever go away from it, don't start looking for happiness somewhere else because it's a spiritual thing, not a physical thing. So God says may you be a great soul who keeps the blessing of happiness of Brahmin life with you at all times. Now underline this word all times. Are we always happy? Conditions apply, right? And these conditions come when we are feeling physically conscious, when we are looking at our physical attainments, when we are looking at how fast or quickly do we solve our physical worldly problems. And that brings in happiness or sadness. But God says that spiritually you can be detached from any kind of problems, whether it's getting solved or whether it's not getting solved, but you can be happy forever. So, that's a spiritual learning which we learn in Brahma Kumaris. Happiness is your birthright of Brahmin life and to be constantly happy is greatness. See, whenever we become a Brahmin, we become soul conscious. And non-Brahmin means body conscious, which is the whole world is actually. Physical features, physical looks, physical beauty, physical attainments is body consciousness, which is not constant and that's why their happiness and mood are also not constant. As compared to soul consciousness, Soul doesn't depend upon any material things, anything around them. So if you think of yourself as a soul, you are happy. If you think of yourself as a body, you are never going to be happy. So those who keep this blessing of happiness with them at all times are great. So never lose your happiness. Because if you become body conscious, you lose your happiness. Problems will come and go in the physical world. But your happiness should not go. Because problems are external situations that have come from others and they will come and go. They are not going to be constant because nobody can be angry with you forever. Nobody can be nobody can be revengeful, revengeful with you forever. Happiness is your own property and you always keep whatever belongs to you with you at all times because it belongs to me. It belongs to me. Soul consciousness is something which I have adopted and it belongs to me. Nobody can take it away from me. So even if you have to leave your body, now who is God talking to? He's talking to us souls. Body cannot leave the body, right? There has to be some other entity in the body who has to leave the body. And that is the true entity, the immortal being that we are. I am a soul, you are a soul sitting in this body right over here as a spark soul. And even if you have to leave your body, God says, he's talking to us souls. Do not let your do not let go of your happiness. When you leave your body in happiness, you will receive a new and beautiful body. That is the crux. If you leave your body with sadness and with a lot of tension and stress, automatically the next family parents which you receive will have the same sanskar, same vibrations because they'll always be tensed and unhappy and discontented. So if their vibrations are as such, then what kind of physical body will they give it to you? A body which is not going to be so healthy, right? Having different ailments. So this is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris to learn more about these things, about rebirth and what happens to you in your next life and how to be constantly happy. Do visit a Brahma Kumaris center nearby you. Om Shanti with this.